Hello everyone and welcome. Today we're going to be looking at a new pair of binoculars that I just got. You see, I have an old pair of binoculars that I've had for around 40 years. They were really expensive when I bought them back in Sears back in the 1980s. At that time, I thought bigger was better. So I got myself the biggest binoculars that I could find, thinking that that was the best way to go. Well, years later, it turns out that I never used them because they're way too big, too bulky, and they weigh a ton. So as with everything in life, lesson learned. So the other day, while I was shopping on Amazon, I came across this pair of binoculars that we're going to be looking at today. They look very compact, lightweight, and they have a cool attachment so you can look to them while using your cell phone. How cool is that? On top of that, they were also a fantastic price. So I grabbed them and I decided to make a video to share with you guys. So today we're going to be looking at this compact and lightweight pair of binoculars from Azolin. And if you've been looking for a pair of binoculars lately, you may want to look at these guys. So let's take a look at them and see how they perform. But before we do that, if you enjoy watching honest tool and product reviews plus helpful DIY projects, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you get notified every time I produce another product review video or DIY video. All right, here's a shot of the box for you. Let's open these guys up and see how they look. All right, guys, so when you unbox this guy, this is everything you get. Now, this is the 12 by 42 HD binoculars from Azulin, available on Amazon, link in description below. At the time of making this video, this kit retails for $49.99. But they also have a 50% discount coupon on their Amazon page, bringing all this down to around 20 bucks, which is a bargain. And that's one reason I decided to share this with you guys, because if you're looking for binoculars, you can get it for around 20 bucks right now, which is a really great deal. Like I said, I've paid a lot more for binoculars, so 20 bucks is a bargain. So what do you get when you unbox this guy? Well, you get the binoculars themselves, get the owner's manual that tells you everything about the binoculars and how to take care of them, but it doesn't tell you how to use some of the stuff on here. So if you bought these guys and you have questions about how to use some of the stuff, do not worry. I'm going to walk you through how to do a lot of the stuff right now. So keep on watching. So you also get a little cleaning cloth to be able to take care of your binoculars and not scratch them up. You get a little mini tripod and a little adapter for the tripod to be able to use these guys together. And the cool thing is that that's a universal use tripod. You can use that for your camera, cell phone, all that stuff as well. So not just for the binoculars, anything else you have, you can use that there as well. You have a shoulder strap to attach it to there so it's easy to carry around when you're moving around and doing stuff. You have a nice little pouch to keep it all stored in. And you get this cool adapter right here that we'll look at later, which is basically for putting your cell phone on here so you can look through the binoculars with your cell phone, take pictures of scenery, whatever, all that kind of good stuff. It magnifies whatever your cell phone sees. So if your cell phone can't zoom too far out, this guy should be able to help you to do more. We're going to look at that a little bit later. Now, this guy comes with a one-year warranty. And the dimensions on this guy are 5 inches by 3 inches by 2 inches in thickness. So it's not too bad, fairly compact. It has a 12 time magnification, a lens diameter of 42 millimeters, and 18 millimeter eyepiece. It has an FMC lens coating, which stands for fully multi coated, which basically means it has multiple optical coats to reduce glare, improve color, visual quality, etc. The weight in this guy is only one pound, which is really lightweight. Like I said, my other binoculars are probably around five or six pounds. Try holding that up for a long time, looking at birds or scenery or whatever. You get really, really tired. Now these have a back four prism, which is better than back seven. That's BAK four instead of BAK seven. And that refers to the prism or shape of the lens having a better refractive index with the back four. And back BAK stands for a German word, which I can't pronounce, so I'm not going to even try. It has an eye relief of 15 millimeters and an exit pupil diameter of 4.2 millimeters. It has a wide angle viewing of 342 feet or 1,000 yards wide field of view. Now that's all the technical stuff for the tech nerds out there. Now let's talk more about the usual stuff that more people are interested in, how the binoculars work, how they function, and how they feel to use them. So they have a lot of adjustability for just about anybody to be able to use them. Basically, you see that they are a nice little shape. They're your standard binoculars. I'll just give you a quick look at them real quick right there. And they have nice little covers on the front and on the back. The covers on the back pop off and they have 
little inserts right there so you can attach them to your strap or something like that so you don't lose them. The covers on the front basically stay attached so you don't need to worry about ever losing them. Just pop them down, do your viewing, and then pop them back up whenever it is that you're done. Very convenient that way. So back here, you have a lot of different adjustments. This is your focal adjustment right here for distance and so forth. It brings it further in and out. Over here, you have your adjustment for your right eye so you can focus everything and adjust it to your right eye, your left eye, all that. Get it all nice and comfortable. It has these cups here that also go in and out to adjust them to the shape of your face. They move independently of each other and you can adjust them to whatever is more comfortable for you. Whether you're wearing glasses or not, they do adjust in a multitude of different ways to make it comfortable for you. They obviously also open up and close like any pair of binoculars to make it comfortable for you for the distance of your eyes and so forth so it's easy for you to view. And as far as attaching the binoculars to the tripod, I'm sure you're looking at them going, well, how do I do that? Where does that happen? Well, there's a funny little thing right here. There's a little attachment right here that unscrews. And if you unscrew this guy right here, it's like a little cup. You have to reach in there and unscrew it. And it's a little plastic cover for the screw for the tripod mount. So this guy here, you just unscrew this little guy right here and you see a screw mount right in there, right in the middle right here. And that is where the tripod mount attaches. You just attach it right onto there. You attach it right onto there like that. So that's what you're looking at. It is mounted to the tripod attachment like that. And then all you do, once it's nice and secure on here, is you attach your tripod to it. You have a couple of different holes to be able to put it in, depending on what's convenient for you. Attach your tripod. Open up the legs on the tripod. And there you go. You have it mounted on your tripod right there. That's what it looks like and get it nice and tight so it doesn't keep flopping around. And there you have it. That is your tripod attachment right there. That's looking at it from every angle so you see what it looks like. And then you just put it down and adjust it up, down, wherever you want. It is adjustable. It does have a ball socket on here so you can adjust it up, down, any angle that's convenient for you. So that's how you attach it to your tripod. One cool thing about this is that it has a nice rubber overmold over the entire body of binoculars, making it very comfortable and convenient for you when you're holding it. Whether you have dirty, greasy hands or whatever, you're going to get a nice grip and you won't have any trouble holding on to them. They won't get hot on hot sunny days, etc. Makes it much more comfortable for you to use them. Now with these guys here, like I said, in a moment I'll bring out my cell phone and we'll take a look at how to attach them. And you should be able to attach it back here and put the cell phone on here so you'll be able to see through your cell phone what the binoculars are looking at. So these guys are really great for bird watching, hunting, enjoying scenery, sporting events, hiking, and more. Your typical stuff that you can do with any pair of binoculars. Here's a real good deal right here with a bargain of binoculars you can get right now on Amazon. So let's take a look a little closer at how to set up the cell phone. And if you want to see the comparison between my new and old binoculars, you can see it right here. You see the old ones are double the size and double the weight. That's why I never wound up using them. All right, so this is what it looks like when you have it mounted on the tripod and you have your phone attached to it. And you can put your phone in portrait, landscape mode, whatever you want to do it. But either way, you just swing it around. The arm swings to whatever suits your phone. You attach it on there and looks through the viewfinder. You secure it with that. And that's what it looks like. So let's go outside and see what it looks like to look through the image. All right, guys, here we have everything mounted up and ready to go. And I'm going to show you what it looks like to use your phone to take pictures or video looking through the binoculars. Because this device can come in really, really handy if you want to take pictures or video like when bird watching or watching sports from far away. Anything that the binoculars can help you to get a better zoom, a greater zoom from further away than what your phone can do. 
And there's the plant that we're looking at over there. Not extremely far away, but you see that it looks really, really good. Probably better than the optical zoom would do on the phone. So that's the beauty of this. You're using a lens to zoom it instead of a digitized image. So there you go. It looks very, very nice. You can use this for all sorts of stuff. And even for handicapped people that can't hold up the binoculars very well, this can come in very handy for that. So there you have it. All right, guys, there you have it. A review and demonstration of a really cool pair of binoculars. I think this pair of binoculars is really great. They're lightweight, compact, bring a ton of accessories, and are very affordable. For around 25 bucks, you can get a complete binocular kit that brings everything you need to enjoy bird watching, scenery, or sporting events from far away. It also brings a really cool attachment to help you take video or photo with your cell phone. Very convenient for all sorts of situations. Check out their Amazon page for complete details. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye for now.